What up, everybody? I'm just coming back to talk about uh this damn Jimbo Fish in Texas A&M. I knew it was something going on down there with that damn recruiting. They have never had the number one recruiting class. But all of a sudden, this year they got a number one recruiting class after the NIL was approved and shit. But you know what? We all knew. We all knew it, it was – that was why them guys was going down there, man. They got seven five stars and I think 18 four stars or some shit like that. But anyway, I mean, it was reported that <laughs> Texas A&M have paid out $30 million to, to recruits, man. But old Jimbo in his old ways, he's denying it. You can't deny it, Jimbo. It's obvious, man. And in a way... You really told on yourselves because you was like, when they said something to you about it, what, what did you say? Oh, it didn't affect recruiting. <laughs> but then you go on to say it's a joke. So, I mean, come on, man. You you, you know Texas A&M paid that money, man. I mean, $30 million. I mean, you offering these guys money and you trying to say it ain't, ain't, ain't affecting recruiting. That's bullshit because you know what? If I'm a kid getting recruited to any college, I don't give a damn. And they offering money, I'm going to the damn highest bidder. And Texas A&M, in a lot of these situations, y'all were the highest bidder. Basically, you're buying your program. That's what you're doing. You're buying these guys. But, hey, it's legal. NIL, it's legal. So, hey, do what you do. But that's what you're doing. I mean, why deny it? You ain't going to get in trouble for it. So what's the point in denying it? But this this uh this been out for quite a while now that y'all, you know, paying a pretty penny to these recruits. I mean, it was all month last month. It came out early last month. So and it's still going on. It's finally an amount and came out. But uh I don't know why you would deny it, because that's this is where college football is going now. So with with the NIL. So it's going to affect a lot of programs, and, and, and it's affecting y'all, Texas A&M, in a good way. So, <laughs> I don't give a damn how many recruits you pay or how much you pay them. Alabama coming for that ass, and you can believe that. So, uh, Jimbo Fisher, Texas A&M, you can pay all the money you want to pay. I can almost guarantee you won't win a national championship. You won't win the SEC. You won't win the West. So I don't give a damn how much money you pay. But uh, it is what it is. Jim Bowles, you can sit up there. You can lie. You can you can speak the untruth or whatever you want to do or call it fake news. But uh, <laughs> y'all paying these goddamn guys. And y'all paying them a pretty penny. $30 million? $30 million? These guys, hey, it is what it is, man. But uh, that's all I wanted to talk about, how Jimbo then, then, then say this ain't true, that they been paid $30 million. He, matter of fact, he said it was an insult to, to his staff. <laughs> what the insult is, is you lying about it. Because everybody know, man. Everybody know. It's what everybody do. I mean, they been doing it. It was just illegal at the time. And if you got caught, you just take the punishment. Now, it's not illegal. So, you know damn well the teams or uh, programs were doing it when it was illegal. They going to do it now. That is not illegal. So, just be upfront about it. I mean, damn. It's NIL. It's legal. That's what that's what that's what it is now. So, but anyway, hell of a, I I want to get I would want to get paid too, shit. But uh, it is what it is, man. So Jimbo Fisher, Texas A and M, hats off to y'all for getting getting all these guys, these all these five stars and four stars. Hats off to y'all. Hey, if I was a coach, I hell I'd probably be doing the same thing to get to get these uh to get these uh. High-rated recruits, man. Try to win me a national damn championship. But uh, Jimbo Fisher, it ain't going to work out for you. I promise you.
I promise you that. But that's all I got to say about that, man. There's some more news coming across the net about this damn Bill O'Brien, man. So I'm going I'm to I'm talk about that. But anyway, uh, I can't do my videos in my regular spot because I'm in the process of giving my man cave a makeover. Yes. So I do, I've been thinking about doing this after a while, man. I think I'm going to make it like a, 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 a whiskey lounge, whiskey and cigar lounge, man. But uh, I'm going to still pay my tribute to my Alabama Crimson Tide in some way. I promise you, in some way, they're going to fit in in this little theme I got going on. But anyway, I just want to talk about old Jim Bowfish in Texas A&M and uh, this $30 million that they done paid out. But anyway, roll tide.